Hey guys, welcome to Fit After 50. Welcome to today's workout. Today we have a high intensity interval training home workout. That's hard for me to say. So it's a HIIT workout done right here from home. Before we get started, let me just tell you real quickly what high intensity interval training is supposed to be like versus what it actually is here on YouTube or on the internet anywhere else. It is supposed to be 10 to 15 seconds of very explosive movement done in all out maximum effort followed by a long period of rest. Nobody is gonna do that type of workout at home. It's something maybe you go out on a track or you go outside, nobody really does that at home. Nobody puts that much effort into anything and then followed by that much rest. That's exclusively you know, safe for athletes, professional athletes, they had all day to work out. We don't do that here. For what we do here on the internet and on YouTube and me is something like a 40 second training interval followed by a 20, 30 second resting interval. And this is what this workout is going to be. For this workout, we only have four different exercises. We have a squat, a push up, a skater, and a little bit of hopping, just hopping in place. We're gonna do the exercise for 45 seconds and then we are going to rest for 15 seconds and we're gonna go through everything three times. So it's gonna be a 12 minute workout. I want you to do these exercises in a very specific way, however. When you're squatting, I want you to go down slowly, take a little pause, and then hop back up as fast as you can. And this is gonna be the same for all four exercises. For a push up, it's gonna be the same thing, nice and slow and negative, and then you're gonna explode up. Skaters, gonna be the same thing. That's how we're gonna progress through these workouts, through this workout today. Nice and easy on a negative and then explode up as fast as you can. As we get older guys, that explosion, that rebound, that's what we kind of start lacking. So this high intensity workout, that's where the intensity is gonna be. You're gonna de depend on your strength going down and then you're an explosive power going up. So let's not waste any more time. Give me a second, let me start the clock and I'll see you guys in one second. All right, and we are back. We'll get started in 30 seconds with our high intensity interval training workout, specifically designed for adults. I am 53, so this is specific designed for people that are, you know, not as nimble maybe as they used to be. We'll get started in 20 seconds. We're starting with a squat. Remember, nice, slow, negative, and then hop up. You don't have to jump up. I just want you to come up quickly. We're gonna do this for 45 seconds, then we're gonna take a 15 second break, just enough for us to transition to the next exercise. So let's get going. Five four, three, two, one, squat down and come up. You don't have to jump, down, pause and up. That's the intensity I wanna see, and up. Come up as quickly as possible and up. Up, looking good. 25 seconds left and up. Like I said, you don't have to hop at all. I'm kind of hopping, but my toes are sort of on the ground and up, down, pause, up, down, pause, and up. Come on, work it with me, less than 10 seconds left, and up, three, two, one, and last one, and up. All right, now we get down on the ground, we're doing a push up, same idea, slow negative, and then pop up as fast as you can, all right? Let's get going, and we got what, five seconds? All right, let's get to a plank position. Three, two, one, let's go slow down. Pause and up. Keep nice, good plank, down, pause and up. These are difficult, pause and up. If you have to drop down to your knees, quite all right. If not, keep on doing them. Down, pause, up, or do, you know, Three this way and three the other way, it doesn't matter. As long as you put your good effort in and up. 15 seconds left. And up. Pause. And up. Let's do one more. And up. All right. We're getting back up and we're going to skaters. So these are side to side jumps or lunges. Same thing. Explode across. Pause and explode across the other way, all right? 45 seconds. Remember, we're going through this entire thing three times. Boom. And boom. And across. Squat down and explode. 
Squat down and to the side. And to the side. You're looking good. And to the side. And to the side. And across. Keep going. 20 seconds left. And up. Squat and explode to the side. Three seconds, two, last jump, boom, we're done. Whew, guy gets heart rate moving just a little bit. All right, we got 10 seconds left. And now we're just gonna hop. You can pretend you have a jump rope. If not, I just want you to hop in place. Your heels should not really touch the ground, just keep on hopping. That's it, that's it, that's all there is to it. Just get those feet off the ground just a little bit. Heels don't hit the ground. We're hopping. We're pretending we got a jump rope. We're just stretching. We're just hanging out for 45 seconds. That's gonna be the first round. We got two more rounds. Same exercises, same intensity. Be as explosive as you can. Remember, that's what we're working on. We're working on getting back that elasticity back into our muscles. All right, got five seconds left, guys. Give yourselves a hand. Let's get ready for number num round number two. All right, let's relax. Back to the squat. Slow negative, pop back up. Slow negative, pop back up. That's all I want to see. You guys ready? In five, four, three, two, one. Squat down and up. Like I said, if you want to hop, that's fine. And up, down. Pause, up, down, give me a pause, and up, and up, and up, and up. Come on, less than 20 seconds left. Pop back up, looking good. I say looking good, you guys go feeling good, ready? Looking good, I wanna hear you. Looking good. One more. Looking good. Three, two, one. Last hop. And we stretch it out. We get it on, on the ground for push-ups. I'm going to try to keep my core tighter. Then it feel very tight in the last set. Give me a little better effort, right? Three, two, one. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down, up, looking good, come on, up, down, up, let's go, down, up, hold it, up, less than 20 seconds, up, Last 10 seconds, about to say less than 10, now it is. Down, up, and three seconds, I'm gonna call it. Whew. Yeah, push-ups are definitely the toughest part of here. All right, my workouts are work your workouts, and vice versa. My runny nose, hopefully not your runny nose. Anyway, we're going skaters. Three, two, one. Squat down, and up cross. Across strong and quick, boom. Explode, boom. Quick, pop. That's it, that's it, come on. Quick, get across that space as fast as you can. 20 seconds left, keep hopping, keep skating. Ten seconds. Pop up, three, two, one, and then to center. All right, we're hopping in place in 10 seconds. Catch your breath a little bit. Hey, I gotta catch my breath. Remember, high intensity intervals. I want that intensity to be high. Not so much on a negative, but the explosiveness. So here, hopping on your toes, hopping on your toes. Keep it up. 
We only have one more round of exercises left to complete our 12 minute workout. Hopefully your heart rates are going. Hopefully you feel this tomorrow, but also recover quickly from it so we can get right back at it. Real high intensity workouts, like I said, once performed by athletes, require a long recovery because the intensity has the tendency to be much higher. Here, we don't want to go too high because we don't want to get hurt. I am brittle. I want to come back and, you know, go to work tomorrow, do some yard work, and also get a workout in without falling apart. That's what we strive here for here after, after 50. Consistency, 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 and consistency. The only way to do that is not to get injured. All right, three, two, one, squat and up. Squat down and up. Down, keep it up, up. All the way down and all the way up. All the way down and stay with me and up. Less than 30 seconds, boom. Come on. And up. Down and up. Keep it here and up. Looking good. Up. Down. Up. Down. And up. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. And those are done. We're done with the squats for the day. All right. Here is the hardest part for me, at least, is the push-ups. The first three or four go okay. Then I start bending a little bit. Lose a little momentum. And let's go down, up, down, hold it, up, down, up. Stay with me, down, up, beautiful, up, up, 20 seconds left, up, down, hold, Beautiful. Keep it here. Up. 10 seconds. Up. Keep going. Last one. Hold it. And up. And there goes our clock. All right. Skaters, nice and powerful strides from side to side, guys. Last set. Make it count. Last set, best set. Let's go. Come on. Five, four, three. Ready? Two, one. Hop across. Boom. And boom, and quick. Quick, boom. That's why I want to see quickness. Whatever you got left. Gather yourself at the end. Don't just hop back. Gather yourself and then push. Gather, push. Come on. Nice little workout here. No equipment required. Simple exercises. Three, two, one. Last one. All right. Now we just happen. We got 45 seconds of happen in place left. My heart rate is going. Hope your heart rate is going. We're not done yet. Not yet. Not yet. 45 more seconds. We get started in three, two, one. Come on. Let's go hop with me. This is it. Let's set it hopping. Work those calves. Get a little bit of balance. Nice soft landings. Come on, stay with me. Come on. 25 seconds left, heart rate's rushing. Feeling good. 20 seconds. Almost done, almost done. Hop, hop, hop. No faster, no slower. Just explode up. 10, 9, 5, 3, this is it. 2, 1, and we are done. That's it, guys. This was our high intensity interval training from home without any equipment. We also went through a little explanation of what high intensity interval training actually is, how it is done by most of us here at home, and how it is done by people that are actually training for something. Um, we are just training for better health and better, a little bit of better fitness, right? Anyway, 
My name is Paul. This is Fit After 50. Workout come, workouts do come out every Monday and every Thursday for almost five years running now. We have not missed an upload. Like I said, consistency is very important. So if you enjoyed this workout, if you learned a little bit something, give me a big old thumbs up, leave a comment down below. And if you're considering coming back, do subscribe and I'll see you guys through your next workout.